Hello friends, welcome to GMK Tutorials. In this video, we are going to see about the octal number system. So, octal number system is used in the digital systems, right? So, in case of the octal number systems, the number of digits are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Therefore, the total number of digits in the octal number system is total number of digits is equal to in the octal number system total number of digits in the octal number system are 8. Therefore, uh, uh, the radix of the decimal, uh, the radix of the octal, octal number system is 8 only. Therefore, radix are uh, base of the base of the octal number system is 8 if you want to represent the positional weight of the corresponding octal number system we know that generally this is a positional weight this is nothing but a radix point a minus 1 a minus 2 a minus a so a naught a1 a2 the powers of the corresponding octal numbers can the positional weight of the numbers can be represented as 8 power minus 1, 8 power minus 2, 8 power minus 3, 8 power 0, 8 power 1, 8 power 2. So this is a positional weight of the octal number system. This octal number system is uh, previously used in the mini computers. Okay, used in the mini computers. Octal number system it is used in the it is used in mini computer system. Okay, present day systems are used in hexadecimal system. Nowadays systems are used in hexadecimal number system. Suppose let it be considered uh, a number that is nothing but suppose if it is a 45 is a octal number system. Let it be considered. If you want to convert this uh, octal number system to decimal number system, how can you represent this one? Uh, it can be converted in the form of a right 5 into 8 power 0 and 4 into 8 power 1. So this is the scenario. So 4, 8, so 5 into 1. So that gives rise to what is the value? 8 4 is 32 plus 5 that gives a 37. That means decimal value of 37 is equal to 45 in case of the octal number system. So let it be see whether it is a possible or right. So the conversion is already discussed in the next two previous classes. Let it be see. So 37 is a decimal number. So this decimal number can be converted into the octal number system 8. So how can you convert? This is the process actually. Mm, 8 fives, uh, 8 fours are 32, right? So 32 remaining is 5. So it is given as 45. 45 is a octal number system. Right. So this is a scenario of uh, octal number system. In case of the any number uh, with octal number system or decimal number system, the in case of the octal number system, the number is not greater than that of the eight seven only. So that number compulsory, the all the digits in the octal number system must be in the range of zero to seven only. Eight is not present in the octal number system. In case of the decimal number system, the numbers are present from zero to 9 only. Okay. So that is nothing but about the octal number system. How we are going to uh, converting the octal number system to decimal number system and how we are converting the decimal number system to octal number system. Where this 8 is represents the corresponding number system. This is generally called as a radix of, radix of the number system. It is also called as a radix. Right. It is also called as a uh, radix of the number system. In case if you want to convert a one number system to another number system, uh, within the brackets they cannot mention whether it is a. At that time, based on this number, we can identify how we are going to converting from which number system we are going to convert. Okay, and a number system which just make a number system paid mention chale that they convert and chale that they. In bracket ki bidder you know suffix lo unni kada. This suffix represents the uh, the converted. Uh, to which form you are going to convert it. So that is nothing but 
ఆక్టల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ అయితే ఎయిట్ ఉంటుంది డెసిమల్ అయితే టెన్ ఉంటుంది బైనరీ అయితే రాడిక్స్ టూ ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ అయితే సిక్స్టీన్ ఉంటుంది రైట్ సో ఐ థింక్ ఇట్ ఈస్ వెరీ క్లియర్ రైట్ సో కమింగ్ టు ది నెక్స్ట్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ ఓకే సో ఇన్ కేస్ ఆఫ్ ది ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ విల్ కంటిన్యూ ది సేమ్ టాపిక్ సో ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ ఇన్ కేస్ ఆఫ్ ది ఎగ్జా డెసిమల్ నెంబర్ సిస్టమ్ it is uh, mostly used in the digital computer it is used in the digital system or computer total number of digits in the octal number uh, hexadecimal number system is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 capital A B C D E comma F this is the total number of uh, digits present in the hexadecimal number systems therefore total number of digits in the hexadecimal number system is nothing but total number of total uh, number of digits is equal to 16 therefore the radix of the radix are base of hexadecimal number system hexadecimal number system is 16 the positional weight of the corresponding hexadecimal number system can be represented as can be represented as positional weight of the number system can be represented as like this this is nothing but a decimal point a minus 1 a minus 2 a minus 3 a not a1 and a2 these are the digits in the hexadecimal number system generalized representation where this represents the positional weight 16 power minus 1 16 power minus 2 16 power minus 3 16 power 0 16 power 1 16 power 2 this is the positional weight of the number system okay this is the positional weight okay this is generally called the positional weight positional weight okay this is generally called as digits right suppose if you want to convert the, uh, any number from hexadecimal so here uh, capital a represents some numbers will be uh, hard to consider a is equal to 10 in the binary uh, sorry decimal b is equal to 11 c is equal to 12 d is equal to 30 e is equal to 14 f is equal to 50 these are the numbers uh, we are taking in case of the hexadecimal number system suppose if you are writing any number that can be uh, represented in the hexadecimal let it be considered 48 is a hexadecimal number let it be considered i don't know exactly so for that just for our assumption point if you want to convert this uh, hexadecimal number system to a uh, decimal number system let us see the what is a decimal equivalent number so basic scenario is how to convert that one so we can represent positional weight format so generally first one is nothing but 8 so 8 into a power 0 sorry that is nothing but 16 power 0 plus 4 into 16 power 1 so that is equal to 16 4 64 plus 16 power 0 is equal to 1 therefore right that is equal to what is the value actually 64 is nothing but 72 decimal number of 72 is equal to hexadecimal number of 
16. So let us see, is it possible or right? Right? So can you check it whether this is correctly or not? 72, right? 72 number can be represented as like this. If you are finding the uh, hexadecimal value of 72 or 16, um, 16 fours are 64, 64 and uh, uh, 8, right? So that can be represented as the remaining value is nothing but 8. So therefore, 48 is the hexadecimal number of 72. So this is a process how we are going, uh, how we are converting from hexadecimal number systems to hexadecimal number system to decimal numbers. It is nothing but decimal number system and how we are converting from decimal number system to it is a decimal number of 72 so decimal number system to decimal to hexadecimal so so with this finally uh, we will come to the end of the number system concept so let us uh, give a, a brief introduction so, in digital logic, the number systems are compared to the total of four number systems. First, decimal number system, second one, binary number system, third one is nothing but octal number system, fourth one, hexadecimal number system. So, decimal number systems are uh, it can be total number of digits in the decimal number system, such as 0 to 9 in the decimal number system. So, so, the radix of the number system and the total number of digits low, number system low, any digits will be done in radix and system. Let the base of the number system are good. Coming to the, it is a general example, this we will take based on the positional. These are the positional weight of the digits as well as the corresponding number systems, right? Coming to the binary number system, we will use the number system and the digital system. The number system low, binary number system low, two numbers will be that is nothing but 0, 1 and the total number of digits which is 2 type of the radix of the binary number system money. 2 and chetam, these are the positional weights these are generally called as a positional weight of the number system it is called as a positional weight right this is generally called as a digits in the number systems right so this is the scenario so, bit and a binary digit and chapter, whether it is a 0 or 1 or 1. Nibble and a group of 4 bits are generally called as a nibble. Let it be considered, suppose if you are taking 4, 0. It is a nibble. If you are taking a byte, means sir, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, this is generally called as a byte. This is generally called as a nibble. Because of group of 4 bits. It is nothing but a group of 8 bits. So that's why it is called as a byte. So binary number systems can be represented as like this. So LR2 under that is nothing but a binary number system. Coming to the octal number system. Octal number system ni manam total ga 7 digits unta 0 to 7. Total number of digits such as 8 unta hai ga. Okay. Radix of the octal number system ni manam 8 and check them. Okay na. So this represents the positional weight. Okay. This represents the positional weight of the corresponding weight. So this is generally called as a digits. So manaki total value covalent digits are multiplied with the positional weight then only you can get the uh, sum of the corresponding number system. So let it be considered simply just the double chapter. So that is nothing but a naught into r power 0 right a1 into r power 1. So this is nothing but a2 into R power minus. So this is generally this is gives rise to final number, final digital number. Okay. So coming to the hexadecimal point of flow, the inflows, total number of digits in the hexadecimal number system is 0 to 15 on diagonal total that is equal to 16. So the radix of the number system on 16 and chapter, it is mostly used in the nowadays computers. Okay, how to converting decimal number system to binary, sorry, decimal number system to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to decimal. So with it is, uh, we can wind up the topic on number systems, on the classification of number systems.